Improving access to Baltimore's bike share program. A new grant from the downtown partnership will help lower income riders afford this mode of transportation. Tracy Leong with when it will be available. Downtown Partnership is offering a $10,000 grant to greatly reduce the price for lower income riders. Launching just two months ago with 21 stations and 185 bikes, the Baltimore Bike Share Program has proven to be a big hit. Another alternative is wonderful for us to have. The program is now planning to expand operations by spring of 2017, and Downtown Partnership is playing a major role. Downtown Partnerships grant will enable uh, lower income residents across Baltimore uh, to access this program at an 80% discount, and we think that's uh, uh, removing an important barrier to uh, the program. To qualify for these access passes, riders must already be enrolled in the Maryland Food Supplemental Program. The city hoping other organizations follow Downtown Partnership's generous move to grow this program and transform Baltimore's community. Uh, bikes reduce uh, congestion, they improve public health. There's a, a whole host of uh, social and economic benefits that come with uh, cycle track. Baltimore's bike share program is the largest electric assist bicycle fleet in North America and are available to rent 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We're excited to watch the city uh, expand bike share uh, beyond its current capacity and, and really take it citywide and we're just happy to be part of it. These access passes will be available in the spring of 2017 for the first 200 people who sign up. They'll also be given a free helmet. Reporting in Baltimore, Tracy Leong, WJZ Eyewitness News. And the bike share program plans to offer 50 stations by next spring. So you can cycle to one area and drop the bike off. That makes sense. And then walk the rest of the way. Right. Home. Or <laughs> take the bike back. We'll have to give it a whirl. Well,